News Specialist Jed Bull joined us live tonight. Jed, you talked with a professor at the U who says vaccine protection for the high risk may actually be waning here. Yeah, exactly, Mike. You may recall that back in August, those who are immunocompromised became eligible for a third dose of vaccine, and that's considered fully vaccinated for that population. The CDC says they are now ready for a booster three months after their third dose of mRNA vaccine. Dr. Hannah Imlay is an assistant professor of infectious diseases at the University of Utah School of Medicine. Her expertise is immunocompromised patients who represent as many as one in 10 people in our state, she says. These are people with some deficit in their immune system. That could be due to an organ transplant, medication like chemotherapy, or because they have an innate deficit. They are at higher risk of death from COVID-19. They are also at higher risk for not responding to the vaccine. So that third dose is really to be considered their primary series. And just like everybody else, that means that immunocompromised patients are due for a booster. But instead of that booster being their third dose, that booster is now their fourth dose. Those who got their third dose in August can now get that booster. Imlay says it's still unknown whether there will be a fifth or sixth dose for those individuals. She's also waiting to see whether the general population will need a second booster. The doctor says that that will depend on the emergence of new variants and also community transmission in the weeks and the months ahead. Mike?